Hey, hey, we're back with more I, the Somnium Files. I keep wanting to say AI, but I think it's supposed to be I. Anyway, before we jump back in today, I did want to talk about one mistake I made in the last video. I mentioned that I thought Seoul was killed in a different way this time, but it seems like that might not be the case, because if you go back to the first route that we kind of finished, the one that got locked, Pewter did mention that Seoul was cut up and found inside a vase in his mansion, so that part is actually the same. But I'm not sure if that means the entire thing was the same though, because back in the video where Boss shot Seoul, we saw very clearly that there was a wound on the side of his head where the bullet went through. But in the route that we just finished, there was a zoomed in picture of his face and it did not show a wound on the side. So the vase part was the same, but was the entire process the same? I'm a little bit hesitant to say that it is. I am relieved to see that similar things are happening though, because if entirely different things happen, then that makes it really hard for us to understand why anyone's doing anything. With that said, let's get back to Ota Somnium then. Do we need a quick refresher here? Cold Storage Warehouse. Relive Ota's memories. Reproduce the fiery battle between Ota and the polar bear. Save Iris, save the world. Yeah. We started out the day with discovering Nadami Shoko. Shoko Nadami. And, uh, well, now we know her eyeball was in Renju's stomach. Then that kind of also means that whoever killed Shoko should have some contact with whoever killed Renju, right? I don't want to explicitly say it's the same person. It probably is, I feel like, or at least they must be accomplices. But, um, there you go. That was a thing. And, hold on. How do I go down? Here we go. After finding Shoko, we had a Somnium. This one was kind of strange though, because why did we have the Somnium again? We were just sitting in the chair watching Mizuki and it happened. We didn't even go to a sink machine. So that makes me wonder too. And this house is freaking Eris' house. And then we meet Eris' mom. And then Mizuki Somnium, which we have to go back to sometime. And then what's this? Oh, discovering Renju. To suspecting Eris. And then going to her Somnium, which leads us to one locked path on this side, but on the other path, it leads to Ota hitting me with a walk. So actually, I'm not even sure why things differ. Because we're not actually doing something different here, right? We're looking at somebody's brain differently. Mm, I guess it's because in this one, if we go this way, we learn about the first Cyclops killer. But in this route, that guy didn't come up at all. Anyway, Ota and Iris don't die here. And now we're at Ota Somnium. On day four. Hello. <laughs> Hey, we have seen these things, but it's good to get a refresher on the beginning anyway. That's right. That's right. That's right. Alright, probably go ahead here. We see the whole thing start off, and now we can start. One thing I did want to try coming back here is, remember how we looked at the ice machine? The ice cutting machine. There were some really big options there, like cutting down Eris, which I was curious about last time, but we didn't get to try, so this time, I do want to try it. Sinking in the swain. <laughs> We're gonna watch this again. <laughs> <laughs> the way he slips is so unnatural. Okay. The first lock is the same, so we can just do the same thing here. What was it again? Was it me trying to... I don't even know. 
Did I lie down or slide or what the hell did I do? I don't remember. These ones are pretty big times though, so I feel like I must have done something else first. Like look at Iris. Get the one second one. And then we can also get the other ones. Wake her up. Yeah. Now with the one second one, can I immediately go try it on the ice cutting machine? It's kind of messed up. Uh, afterwards, we might have to use that bad timey somewhere. Kick, turn it on, or move. Move is a normal move. It's a normal option. Turn it on. Oh, I knew it. They weren't gonna show me Iris getting cut down again, okay? That's kind of messed up. Then I'm guessing the other one will be the same too. <laughs> if we do these options right now, we're done. So I gotta go get rid of my bad timey. How about with Iris here? 20 seconds? We can probably afford it. Yeah, unfortunate. One ninth timey on the wake her up. Do I want to spend 30 seconds and get a one timey? Or do I want to spend 20 seconds and get a one ninth timey? Nah, 20 seconds. Because we can also get the other one later on. Back to what we're supposed to be doing here. I completely forgot what I did last time. Slide. <laughs> Lie down. Um... Huh. These are, yeah, these are really big times, my god. Well, we can definitely try some other things, too. Jumping? Uh, I mean, these ones, it's the difference between, like, one second. It's 10 seconds versus 11 seconds. But if it's a bigger time, then it might be a bigger difference. It doesn't really matter. Jump. Orthodox. Oh! I don't think I did that last time. So there's multiple ways of solving this. <laughs> I never talked about this, but I think this pose here is supposed to be the pose of Ultraman. It's a popular superhero. Just think like... Power ranges and stuff. It's basically what this whole thing is based off of. <laughs> My lord. Alright, we've had enough of this. Thank you. Now we can choose between the green shelf or the red shelf. That shiny thingy! Um, I think someone said that I can kind of walk behind it somehow? Is it possible? Well, definitely not like that. Do I have to move something first? I don't even know. I don't see any cracks anywhere. Like here? Oh my god, are you kidding me? Wow! Keep pressing the wrong thing. No. That's insane! Hey, might as well look at it right now. Do we get it right now? Oh, the B. <laughs> Why did Iva get flattened by the oil drum? Sunfish pocket. Huh. Okay, and this is the Mayumi one that we got last time. Aiba having a drink, looking like the girl behind her. Mayumi. Her glasses are so in. Maybe that's why her shirt says hipster on it. Does it actually say hipster in the original Japanese too? Do Japanese people even know what hipster is? 
It's kind of a strange one. Okay. We have to get Ota to the red shelf. So let's check out the red shelf here. But there's nothing here. There's no, like, interactable thing. What did we do last time? We used the forklift to move the crate over to Ota. Maybe it has to do with the plate and the oil drum? This plate probably just says D. But I never did look at it. Punch it? You can just breathe on it. Yeah. Uh. Maybe punching works too. There might be multiple right answers. D. D. What? What? I'm glad you realized you gotta do work. Phil, roll, smell. <laughs> Iba smelling the oil drum, that's gonna go well. Mmm. Let's roll it first. Get that nice timey over there. Roll it out to the shelf, maybe? And then flatten myself. Oh my god, it says acetone on it! An ASAT! That's the second reference to acetone we've seen. Acetone? Oh! The sign of the hero! The glory of victory! あれはアセトンちゃん。Beautiful. The letter A appears in two different places. The forklift? Hey, I got onto the shelf. Huh. Remote control. Press button. Investigate. Break. <laughs> Let's investigate it first. Actually, can we go look at Iris again? Because I think she has better timies. Yeah, check out that one second one. Use two seconds to get a one second one. Might actually be worth it. No, it's okay, we'll just not use it. By the way, the visual difference between using a timey versus not using it... I feel like the visual design of that is not so good, because it's really really similar, unless if you're paying attention. So sometimes, it seems like I'm using a timey when I'm not, and even I get confused by that too. The surest way to see it is until I finished using the option already, and then it says how many seconds was deducted on the screen. Um... Let us investigate. これは Oh! Okay. But I'm not lifting anything up there, right? Did you want me to look at the power board first?
Here we go. We didn't get this last time. Throw something. Jump. Pray. Pray sounds like a good one. <laughs> hmm. Jump? Like, jump so high that you... Wait, is there like a lever there or what? Jump? Oh, pff, looking up her skirt again. I'm not sure. <laughs> she tried. She tried. Counter attack ignited. Turn on the electricity. Throw something. Where'd you get that? キンキンに冷えてやがる。いいか、相棒。目標のスイッチに向かって投げるんだ。目標のスイッチに向かって投げる。目標のスイッチに向かって投げる。Home run! Cuz that's how baseball works, right? <laughs> Good job, Aiba. Great aim. You better have great aim. You're an eyeball. こいつ本当にイリスを助けたんだよな。真偽はともかく私がオータの最後の希望なんだ。なんとか立ち上がらせてやらないと。全くイライラするな。You <笑> know, I'm thinking about the acetone oil drum. The oil drum is also something that we saw in Iris's Somnium too, and that was a thing that we think Renju was transported to the Sunfish Pocket Cafe in. But does Ota know about that? Was he a part of that? Or maybe Iris told him about it? I'm not sure. Final episode, Brave Hero. True identity revealed? We'll see. Pretty much nothing else that we can look at, right? So we gotta go motivate Ota again. Or, uh, oh, did I need to do something with this? We have time. Go press a button and see what it does. いくぞ。1。何かの音はするが、どこにも反応はないな。きっと私が押すべきじゃないんだ。あいつが押せばもしかしたら。ああ、あいつか。That's true。残り2分ないですよ。急いでください。大田だ。I tried cheering last time. How about encourage? Encourage. Right, we got the thing here where we don't really know how much time this takes. Motivate? Easily motivated. That's a good thing. It's a good trait. <sighs> Feels like we should have won this battle. But because in real life, Ota got stabbed. So even though we get all these contraptions working. Oh my lord! <gasps> Actually, it might play out differently this time because we did the Somnium differently. Really? Oh my god. What? What? 
What? Oh my god! Oh, this can't be good for Ulta. Okay, that was way too suspicious, okay? What the hell was that, boss? How the hell are you gonna explain that? Oh my god! We have plenty of time! We have one full minute! Shou guy hurt, a wound, injury. ひったい何考えてるの? Under normal circumstances, I would appreciate your worry about me, but I'm pretty sure we had more than six minutes. I mean, we had more time left. Even Pewter is agreeing with Boss, so in terms of the story, was that supposed to just be really close, even though in the gameplay, we clearly had enough time? ボスもピュータもモニターで見てたはずだ。もう少しで犯人の顔が見えそうだったんだよ。あの倉庫の中で犯人の顔を見たんじゃ。みんなが何を話してるのかさっぱりわからないけど、とにかく犯人の顔は見てないよ。もしも見てたらとっくの昔に言ってるって。ほらね。I'm a little bit torn because Pewter, we've seen that he doesn't necessarily listen to boss about everything cuz he gave us information about the old Cyclops killer, but he's agreeing with her here about how we almost went past the six minute time limit. So, was that really what happened? Or is it a case of boss trying to stop me from seeing the killer's face? Because that's definitely what they want me to think. まあ、見ようとはしたけどね。what you mean in the Somnium or in real life? Oh, okay, in real life. Ah. Then in the other path, we saw that Ota got stabbed in a different way, but this is the one that's closer to what happened. Hmm. Dang, we were so close, but Ota never got to see the face anyway. The cabinet. Steel shelf. I open it up. It's stuffed with mysterious mushrooms. What? There's a metal shelf by the wall. No! <laughs> when I was like 10, I watched the ring by myself in a um, dark room. And then from that point on, I just couldn't handle anything horror-related anymore. Did I talk about this already? What the hell? Hmm? 
Oh my god, what the heck is wrong with this locker? Locker in the corner. Long table. The one where boss and I consummated our love. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> I can show you the world. Well, that wasn't a table, but close enough. <laughs><笑>制限時間を超えて真空したこと確かに危険だったかもしれない悪かったよ本当に反省してるああじゃあ今度歌舞伎町のホストクラブでピンドリおごってねもしくは今すぐ私の靴を舐めるかああ。<la
今日の午前3時以降に訪れた患者で左の大腿部に思想を負った者は一人もいない Do you think a serial killer would go to the hospital? ソムニウムで見た光景が確かなら相当深い傷だったはずだが自分で応急処置をしたってことかあるいは仲間にやってもらったのかも複数犯だろそうは言ってない仲間と言ったっていろいろあるだろ That's true I relay the information to boss and pewter Boss's leg looks okay to me とにかく犯人は左足に深い傷を負っていることが分かりましたこれは大きな収穫です伊達くん今すぐ外に出て左足を負傷してる人間を探してきてどうやって聞き込みでも何でもすればいいでしょ<笑>無茶言うなよこの東京に一体何人の人間がおななんだ What? おいだてどうしたんだおまいガールだだてくん大丈夫ですか I was okay. What? Says I? Like sanction? Or I mean the, um, the negative meaning of sanction. Because sanction's one of those words with two opposite meanings. t h a t e residence. Tuesday, 8 a.m. Hmm. Why didn't this happen last time? Is it because of the sinking? Because we got near the six minute limit. Ironically enough, this time we had more time left than when I did Ota Somnium the first time around. キャバクラで飲みすぎてぶっ倒れたんだよ嘘をつくな制御室で倒れたところまでは覚えてるだって夕べのシンクで危険なことしたんでしょそのせいで脳に過剰な負荷がかかって意識を失ったってあのボスって人とピュータって人が言ってたお前が、oh、she sounds worried about me I'm so touched 二人に会ったのか伊達をここまで運んできたんだよ最近の操作で疲れも溜まってるだろうからゆっくり休ませてくれってさ She's not really looking at me She's still angry But I think she cares a lot about me I'm basically like half her dad I had a rabbit I gave it to Mizuki on her birthday Large speakers, mostly hollow Audio equipment for an audio file Yeah, we've seen these. Cork board on the wall. PC. Desk. <laughs> At least she's not so angry, she's pumping iron today. <laughs> Big window. Garbage can. Chair. Documents in my file cabinet. Nobody's in the mood for jokes because I passed out. Aiba is like my eyeball, but does she know about my physical aspects? Like, I'm wondering, can she function like a Fitbit? Does she have information on my heart rate, my pulse, and stuff? <laughs> can she tell what was wrong with me that caused me to go unconscious? The entrance. Or the exit? Depending on how you look at it. Mizuki's bed. Mizuki is sitting on the edge of the bed. Mm, did Boss and Pewter say anything? Hmm. <laughs> 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 
お前の脳に目立った損傷は見られない捜査を継続しても問題なさそうだ I love you too, Mizuki. Don't you have school? 休みだよどうして今日は火曜日で平日のはずだがだってって本当無神経だよねきびきに決まってるじゃんあっ、like so、long ago I have to admit I forgot about it too そうか Wait that means the whole time when we're investigating We're just leaving her here. Where's Ota? Biointimodotamitayo?Ota,你辛苦したことは,ゆうべボスが話したんだ。冷凍倉庫で何が起こったのかも。どうしてそこまで?Mizuki,が詰め寄ったんだよ。操作状況を教えてくれって。Mizu
。ありがとう。ありがとう、だて。I got up, grabbed the towel from the sink, and tossed it at Mizuki. それで顔を拭け。出かけるぞ。Why are you like that? Freaking like, wipe it for her or something. <laughs> Mizuki quickly dabbed her eyes with a towel and smiled weakly. Hey, anybody have an injured leg? <laughs> How's that gonna work out? Oh my god. She looks like she just washed her face. She's ready. Yeah, go grab your favorite metal pipe or whatever and we'll get going, alright? l